is facing its largest mass extinction since the disappearance of the dinosaurs. At least a quarter of the world's 8,000 amphibian species are in danger of extinction. This is a fact. The reasons for this phenomenon include habitat loss, viruses, pollution and even climate change. But recently, some amphibian species, particularly frogs that were thought to be lost, have emerged from the dead. But the interesting question is, just how did they escape extinction? They are diminutive in size, but they have held an exalted role over the ages in almost every culture. Frogs have been revered as emissaries of the divine. But they've also been feared as witches' familiars, noxious and baleful. And now, the freshwater populations have crashed by 83% since 1970. In fact, there were species of frogs that were long forgotten and thought to be dead. But they have re-emerged. Chilean scientists have rediscovered a species of frog that was last seen more than 80 years ago. This is the diminutive Hall's water frog, named after the American researcher and collector Frank Gregory Hall, who discovered the species in 1935 in Chile's Atacama Desert. The discovery has prompted calls for the conservation of its habitat. These frogs are strictly aquatic. If they remain out of water for even five minutes, they die. There is a rather serious problem in the north with the water issue and with mining. There are many amphibious species, including this one and others. For example, the loa frog, which is particularly affected by the extraction of water for mining or other purposes. In the north, this is a big issue. These animals are strictly aquatic. In just five minutes out of the water, they die. So I think it is an important measure to safeguard this unique place. Studies estimate that since the 1970s, around 200 frog species have disappeared. There are projections of loss of hundreds more in the next century. Frogs are under threat on nearly every continent. From the French Pyrenees to the Central American rainforests to the Sierra Nevada in California. Bureau Report, Vion, World is One.